Hello everyone. Today I'm playing some more Phasmophobia. Let's see, let me turn up the volume. Okay. Okay. A perfect bonus. Collect bones. Okay. Ghost type. Buy an item. Get the ghost to walk through salt and get an Ouija board response. I'm never getting that. And let's see. So, we need EMF for reader. Survive a hunt? No way we're doing that. And get our sanity low. I think it's possible for me to get our sanity low, but the rest, not so much. The game's updated, so I'm probably going to need to relearn how to play this game a little bit. But we'll get there when we get there. Now, let's see... I'm going to want a flashlight, and then you can hold three things. Let's see. I need a way to... F I don't know what any of this equipment is. Thermometer. I don't think there's anything there. I don't know what this is. I have not even the slightest idea. Wait. Alright, I turned my brightness up a little bit. Since I have a feeling I'll need it. Don't tell me I didn't get the key. Okay, real quick, let me look up what some of this new equipment is. Because I need to get my bearings. Okay, I think I have my bearings now. I was feeling a little overwhelmed. But I think I got my bearings. So now I just need to grab that key. And we can get this show on the road. So let me just run up, open it up. Now step one, we need to get that fuse turned on. Let's see. I think they remodeled this a bit. Wait, don't the lights start on here? Yeah. Okay, on well, step one, let's start closing doors. Turning lights on. Okay. Now that I have a bunch of lights on, this is an EMF reader. I heard something open. No. All doors closed. I hear something. Not in here. But in here. Let's see. Whoops. How do I... Journal? Here we go. I'll figure things out as I get through. Anyway. Let's try to use this in here. Okay, no luck. Okay, no luck. So... This is going to be greatly me trying to get more used to the game's mechanics and all of its little revisions. Let's just set up everything in there. Since it's pretty clear that's the ghost room. Or at least it's mostly probable. Oh, EMF 5. How do I... Oh. Whoops. I have notifications on. One second.
Oh, I thought I paused and I did that. Okay, well. Better hurry. Okay, so I have a camera here. Night vision on it. Can I not? Wait, let me... Can I not just, like, set this down? Maybe I can drop it there? Here, wait, let me set that. Oh, I thought that was a hunt. That's too early. Is there someone here? Is there a threat here? Is there a threat? Am I in danger? Okay, so that's where I put EMF 5. How's my safe time? One minute remaining. I don't suppose the other camera. Yeah. That would have been too easy. Okay. So this is a dots projector. A weaker version of it, mind you. But in some ways, superior. Let's go back on here. If I just drop that? No. I don't like that. Let's see. Did I hear it move out here? Ghost, are you here? Are you here with me? Am I alone? How old are you? Are you here? Am I in danger? Am I likely to die? Let's see... Okay, so it's not spirit box. Okay. Whoops. So this doesn't matter anymore. This, however, does matter. It hasn't gone freezing yet. Which suggests... Let me quickly run out and check my sanity, because I've been sitting in the dark for a while. What's my sanity looking like? Oh, my sanity is bussin'. Okay. So, presently, we know a few things, right? Yeah, we, we know that it's one of four types. It'd be nice if I could get a sign. Let's see, I think Obake is the one that leaves six prints. Let me look at the other ones. Okay, yeah, so we can have an easier time if we see something special from our ghost friend, our haunting friend. Right now, I'm really doubting it's freezing temps, meaning I doubt it's a gin. Like, I'll throw that there, but I just don't think it's likely that it's a gin. That's five. That's five again. Let's see. Yeah, no dice. It's not writing in the book. Oh, wait, I see my breath. Well, this is an updating. I saw my breaths. So that means it's freezing temps, which means it's a gin. Really? Like, I see my breath, so... I guess that's that. In that case, let me head out and confirm that freezing temps still does work that way. I'd like to just play around slightly longer to be sure. Even though I'm reasonably confident at this point that I have a gin on my hands. Yeah, still five. So each time I find those, it looks 
less likely than I'd like to see. I can spawn any ghost orbs. Okay, I really don't know why I'm wasting my time with this. It's so obviously Nabake or an a Jin. I'm just going to. Oh no. Oh what? Is that not a hunt? I'm going to go ahead and head out. Gosh, could you imagine if you had to bring everything with you? Like, unless... I'm pretty sure... That freezing temps means that you... Wait, it was a Goryo? Huh? Okay, so... Apparently, freezing temperatures are no longer indicated by your breath in the air. I've learned something new. So, I guess that's a plus. Let's do another round there. Yeah, I think we should do just another round, make sure we understand the game mechanics. Because this is going to be crucial when going forward. Okay. So. Oh. That's interesting. Well, we're going to need a light source. And since this is the lowest difficulty, it's way easier to just have the ghost be cornered. So I have the light. Let's see. That's good to set up. And then we're also going to probably want to set this up. Come on, can I grab the key? There. Now let's get some lights going here. So we can, it'll make things way easier if we can actually, you know, see. Closed. We'll hold on to this. We're just looking for any signs of haunting activity. Looks like our ghost isn't being active right now, so we'll just drop the book down. And maybe our stat here but that that is noteworthy that we learned a little more about how that works yeah activity is showing as extraordinarily low not really surprising now what do I need let's get EMF and this Apparently the lowest form of this has pretty bad range. So I'd be amazed if I actually find any activity. What we're really looking for here is just literally anything that's necessarily out of place. None of these rooms are... I heard something here. So I think the ghost is in one of these rooms. Oh, hi. Oh, I think this is the ghost's room. How rude to choose the basement of all places. Let's see. 
Well, let's move everything to the foot of the stairwell. And... Now that I have reason to think it's down here... Let's just stop for a moment and see. See if I drop it down. Oh, well, that's not getting any readings right now. But that's not really to be expected. Oh, I still have my box. How's my sanity doing? It's doing great. Those two things will kind of go hand in hand. Let's see, there we go. Hello? Is anyone here? Is anyone haunting this place? Is anyone haunting? Huh. Oh my god, so is anyone haunting? Any evil? Evil? Anyone? Hello? Is anyone haunting this home? Are you haunting this home? Okay, no dice there. Let's try to get the camera, because the camera, in my opinion, is our best bet at trying to help pin down a ghost room. There are two main places I suspect the ghost could be in. But until we lock that down... stand in the light here so we don't go insane. There we go. Now let's look through here. Let's turn the flashlight off so it doesn't interfere. No? Off? Okay, what if I drop the flashlight? Will the camera not light up then? Yeah. That's what I want. Just keep an eye here. Look at that little screen. Not seeing any orbs. Now let's look through here with this. Okay, is this ghost just inactive as heck, or what? Like, I've been trying and trying. Yeah, you see this? Oh, the ghost is doing something. I think they turned off the fuse. Thankfully, I have my trusty flashlight. My... There we go. I'm pretty sure they can turn off the fuse box from anywhere. They didn't even go through here to do that. But here's the trouble. I'm still not 100% on which room they came from. All they've done so far is knock out a light. All the doors are still shut. I don't know that this is the ghost room, but I think it could be. Huh?
Let's step in here with my camera. Just try to see if there's something we can spell it. I'm not seeing any orbs. What about you? No. There's the switch if I want light, but, well, how's this doing here? What if I go at the top of these stairs? My gosh, this ghost is not cooperating in the slightest. So I can't, for the life of me, figure out what their room is. Well, actually, judging by how they've never... Okay, wait, let me try this. I'll open those doors. And I'll turn off the light there. Now let's take a look. Maybe this is the ghost room. Wait, let's get the one thing from the bottom. Right now my current theory is that it was just down here by coincidence. Wait, oh, no, I'm fine. It's not hunting. It did sound like they were over here, so... Oh? EMF5. Did it turn out all the lights? Yeah. Okay. So, EMF 5. Why did I have a breath in here? Turn that back on since apparently I accidentally turned that out. Where did I even throw the book? I think I threw the book around here somewhere. There's the book. Okay. Let's try like this. See if we can spot anything. Wait, here's an idea. Let's drop that there. That way we can look for two things at once while doing this. I guess I left that door open. Let's close that one. I'm not seeing a single even minute indicator. Okay. I'd wonder if the ghost room changed if How do I? Great, I guess it's just going to happen now. There's a way to stop the car, I just don't remember it. But yeah, I'm starting to think the room is in here, which is why I had the breath. Let's 
let's see. Well. Let's engage this here. It's been active a lot around here. But I just am not getting anything to work with. I'd really like to turn off this car. Gosh, I forgot how obnoxious this car thing was. I, I've been in this map for ages, and I'm just not having any luck here. It'd be nice if I was even sure that this was the ghost room. Oh, freezing temperatures. Oh, did you turn off the fuse box? You did. Okay. Wait, I think you just did something. And I'm pretty sure you didn't leave fingerprints. Okay. Let's set that there. Lights are flickering a lot. Let's head outside for a moment. And let's review our choices. I'm... Yeah, my sanity is fine. One of these is irrelevant. I'm pretty sure it's not ultraviolet. One of these does not matter in the slightest. Okay. So it's either dot, spirit box, or ghost writing. Right now I'm leaning towards it being spirit box or dots. Where did I put my flashlight? There. Well, thankfully I don't have to do too much more now, right? So I have the book there. Ghost, how are you doing? Why are you doing this? Is there a purpose? Do you have a purpose? Do you have a purpose? Do you have a purpose? Why are you trying to hunt me? Nothing. Why aren't you doing anything? Is there a reason? Ghost, please speak to me. You turned the light on. Yeah, it's just not leaving ultraviolet. It's not responding to me either for that ma for that matter. Please, ghost, why are you here? Why are you here? How old were you? How old were you? What is your age? What are you? What? <laughs> I can't tell if I'm being hunted. What am I doing? Okay. Oh, that shoe got knocked over. Okay, so let's review. I ran around in circles trying to get this thing to reply to me. 
didn't get one single little reply. So, oh wait, it's probably Dots then. Okay. It's probably an Oni, which are extra aggressive. What's the weakness of Oni? Okay. Then here's my plan. Since I'm now reasonably certain it's probably an Oni, let's just try to get the last bit of proof it requires. To be honest, I don't feel like it's likely an Oni, but... Didn't I have a thing here? Picking up EMF 5, why not? I don't think they can hunt any earlier, so I'm in no danger of getting hunted. And if I'm wrong, I'm dead, but we'll just have to accept that. I don't think it's a ghost that can... It detects something. But the fact of the matter is I'm just not seeing it on dots. So even though I think it's a dots ghost, since I don't see it anywhere... doesn't help this car makes this nightmarish. Maybe it's possible I've seen the ghost already. And the car just undid that. What? Yeah, see? The ghost is right here. I'm not seeing anything on UV. Like, I'm aiming it right at it? Nothing. Okay, let's cross off that then. That's either ghost writing or spirit box. Oh wait, that looks like a hunt. Okay, it wasn't? Cool. I'll just quickly move the writing there. Okay. Did it throw a hammer at me? That's terrifying. Either I'm using some of these tools wrong, or... No, I'm probably using some of these tools wrong. Like, the fact of the matter is, it's not writing in the book. I'm not sure what there is to do about that. If it's not going to write in my book. I'm going to review my suspected pieces of evidence and go from there. Well, I am now in hunt range. Let's just uncross everything. I'm pretty confident it's not a djinn. Which means it's either a shade, oni, or the twins. So let's review our choices for which one it could be. If the remaining is this, Shade will only enter a hunt if no one's around, and they're much harder to find. This is pretty convincing. I could see a Shade. An Oni just doesn't vibe with me. It doesn't feel active enough, if I'm going to be honest. And it has barely drained my sanity. I'm going to lean against an Oni. The last one is the Twins. The twins might be believable. I think it's between the shade and the twins. You know what? It's... I'm going to go shade. I might be completely off. But I am kind of sick of dealing with this thing. I mean, I kind of want to get the average sanity thing, but it, this ghost is taking forever to lower my sanity. It's not working out.
Let's vacate. Let's vacate. And we'll learn, if I'm wrong, which piece of evidence we failed to collect. It was indeed an Oni. Fascinating. Okay. Sure. I'm a little upset about that. I thought I was doing such a good job, but apparently I wasn't. So, let's go for a third round here. Alright. Grab the key. And there's not really much point there. It's cold. Escape a hunt. Ghost event. What do we need? Obviously we need a flashlight. Then we need a tool to help us locate the ghost room. This will help. This will help. Other than that, we just need to see what doors get opened up. I don't understand how the Oni was... ...getting things done. Wait, how did it... ...break that? No, let's not question it. Let's get I lights running around. Yeah, we have lights on, that's good. Other than that, we just need to get this working. Alright, we have some activity over here. Oh? Activity level 3. Cool. Let's look for ghost orbs. Wait. Have to be wary of the snow there. Really? Okay, let me get a little more equipment set up now that I have a possible ghost room down. Let's see. Going to need this. Going to need this. Slowly falling. But going to need. Let's go ahead and set it down there. What the? You're like a zombie. Not sure if a zombie means anything, but... Oh, looks... Yeah, it briefly swings to five. Okay. Why am I... What's with all my EMF5 ghosts? Okay. Well, I've seen you over there now, so let's get a book down there. How are we doing on temperature? Nothing? Okay, well we have more evidence to look for. My sanity should be high unless they have a sanity drain ability. So if my sanity is anything but, nope. They have not observably used any sanity drain capabilities. The second I think I know it's room, I should really be better about getting the rest of my equipment in. How do you fall in the wrong direction? On the 
Let's see, my camera's there. Drop that there. I drop it down and it literally flips itself over in the wrong direction. So, unsurprisingly, when we cut off a good chunk, actually we cut off a lot of ghosts with EMF 5. But we have to do better than just cut off a few. So one step at a time here. Let's just stand back and look for A, ghost orbs, and B. We're also going to be looking for dots, anything on dots. They do a slight advantage. If they're using ghost orbs, it'll be mildly more difficult to recognize thanks to the snow. I'm not getting the impression of ghost orbs for now, though. So let's set that down. Let's check on the temperature. Nothing noteworthy. Let's turn this off just in case that's interfering at all. I don't want to risk any interference. Why are you here? What are you doing? What is your purpose? Do you have a purpose? Why? What are you doing? What are you thinking? Am I asking the right questions? Are there right questions? Spirit. Let's see. Okay. Okay. Hello? This is not leading anywhere, is it? Okay. Okay. Let's see. Apparently there's a LED will turn white if I get a response on this thing. Hello? Is there a feedback to be received from you? Apparently you get a feedback every 10 seconds potentially. Let's see. Wait, it'd probably be, if you're over here, it'd be for the best to, whoops. Get this closer to myself. Temperature. You're probably not freezing temperatures then. Just stand here. Speak to myself. Are you evil? Are you not evil? Are you the evilest evil to ever evil? Are you nice? Are you friendly? Why aren't you doing anything? Why do you continue to be refusing Why do you continue to refuse to do anything for me? How do you expect me to participate here if you aren't going to participate?
Yeah, the lights still function fine. Okay, sure. Where's the camera? Right, I moved it, didn't I? If I stand here, let's look for orbs again. Maybe putting it in the other room made it so orbs wouldn't manifest for me. So we'll just wait. See if we can spot absolutely anything. Since we're spotting nothing, we'll rotate. How am I going to beat this game on higher difficulties when I'm just not even getting evidence? I'm not even sure if I'm playing the update right. The tier 1 gear I have is, like, worse than my previous gear. I'm not seeing any ghost orbs. Nor have I seen the ghost interact with the dots that I have there. So maybe I can improve the placement of the little light if I put it here. Maybe that would be better. No, surely I can place that better. Yeah. I'm going to keep trying to interact with you. Hello? Are you finally going to speak to me? Hello? You're not interacting with anything. Like at all. Oh my gosh. Yeah, so... I haven't been able to confirm one little thing. I've been standing in the darkness there for ages, as you can see. I've lost a massive chunk of sanity. <laughs> Yet, Peter here, Peter here, just goes, no. He responds to people who are alone. You're not responding to me at all. Don't give me that only responds to people who are alone deal. There are too many possible suspects here. What if it was a Goryo again? And the reason it wasn't responding is because I was in the same room as it. Well, what are the evidence of a Goryo? Isn't it also freezing temperature? Right. Gosh, I wish I had more reliable tech. That's something that's definitely gotten on my nerves. Well, first things first, I'm going to take away your ability to drain my sanity for a moment. I heard something over here. But I didn't see you open a door. Yeah, this ghost is trolling me. Anyway. Even though I have reason to think this is the ghost's room, the lack of temperature dropping even slightly is odd. What, are you just not experiencing any activity? Not even a little? What if I turn the lights out? Will that encourage you to activity? I hate how these curtains can just enter my head.
I'm almost starting to think this isn't your room. Could it be in here? Oh? What? I'm sorry? But you didn't open the door. Don't the ghosts have to open doors? Or is this a new change? Gosh, the game's driving me mad here. Okay, so for whatever reason... The ghost just... Are oh, you turning the fuse off? Hilarious. the basement fuse. That was obvious. Since there's only one or two fuse locations. Let's get the basement light on. Now. Oh. Freezing temperature. Okay, so I guess this is the ghost room. It was just coincidence that I had activity over here. Wait, did they actually turn everything off again? Ghost is clearly not afraid about being annoying. Now let's get that camera. I'm reasonably sure I don't need the spirit box. This, however, could be handy. They broke something. Looks like one of the lights over there. Now we wait. Oh, there are ghost orbs, and more importantly, that is the ghost room. Okay. What? Apparently I got impossible evidence. Okay, well I'm absolutely sure of the ghost orbs. I am also sure I had freezing temperatures. The only one that's negotiable is the EMF. Unless, isn't there one that can have fake ghost orbs? There is, but the mimic... If it has fake ghost orbs, it wouldn't have faked an EMF, which means I probably, I'm sure about the ghost orbs, it was really low on the thermostat, so it's not EMF then. How much time do I have? I am running low on my sanity budget. Let's get lights on so I have time to move my equipment. I 
since we know where the ghost is, we don't need anything too special here. My real problem is I'm not sure how I'm going to provoke the ghost into giving me what I want. Really quick, does the spirit box require darkness? Turned off the fuse box again. Well, let me just flip that. We'll just try turning this on just to see if there's the slightest thing we can witness. I heard something open. I heard it. Really? I was so sure I heard something. But there's nothing that could have been open. Everything's shut. Okay, it's been ignoring Spirit Box. I can't be sure on that. All that's left is the RNG mess of ghost writing. Yeah, we're getting freezing temperatures. Okay. Then what what could it be? If it's Yeah, see I keep hearing what it sounds like something getting open. No UV. Let's go. Okay. That's actually such a huge advantage. The fact that we can cross off the UV. Okay, now that we can cross that out. We've never seen it in dots. We've never heard it. Which one's ghostwriting? Revenant? Let's take a look at all of our candidates. Onryo, Yure, and Revenant. Starting with Onryo. Let's see. When threatened. And then the other ones were the Revenant and the Yure. A stronger effect on sanity? Unlikely. And then finally, we have what I suspect it is, a remnant. Unless I provoke a hunt, there's no way I can verify that. But my sanity appears low enough that I am willing to risk it. I did select Revenant, yeah. Let's see if we have it this time. This this is a tough game. Like there we go. Okay. Yeah, I didn't find any bones. Nice, I've unlocked a photo camera. So that's where I'm going to stop. I hope you all enjoyed, and I'll see you all next time. Thanks for watching.